my man's up, he's all right, and he could say, yeah, I went out there and just flipped it in front of a couple thousand people up there in Saskatchewan, dude, life is good, you know? Because that would be awesome. I believe, I believe that's Perry and Al driving around. How about that, my man? Perry Jensen and Al Benasaki driving the big limo around. Now what in the world could be planned for this? Let me... I gotta ask a question because there's like a rule thing here and I guess the question we'll let the people decide is that should a big monster limousine be allowed to be a part of freestyle out here this afternoon or does that does that break the rules and it might hurt somebody's feelings so we can't do it yeah screw that I agree absolutely we're gonna make this part of it Perry are you nervous Better you guys than me. All right. Let's see what y'all... Redneck Royal Treat. I love the flagpole. Seen a lot of that up here, the hockey stick flagpole. I think it's awesome. Scott Green is getting ready in sail. As we said, out of Southern Illinois, making the trip out here this afternoon. And then there's Perry and Al driving around, helping me kill time while they rescue Kyle's truck over there, which it looks like they have. So. Now what in the world could they be planning with that? Whatever they have cooking, I'm sure it's a horrible idea. Ladies and gentlemen, how many of you have ever seen this truck sail, either in person or on video? If you've seen what it's capable of doing, let me hear you make some noise. If you have not, and you're like, who's this guy rolling out that I've never heard of? Well, allow me to make an introduction to you here in just a second. His name is Scott Green. The truck is called Sail. I met Scott Green in North Florida probably seven or eight years ago. And I remember nobody knew who he was and he signed up for the freestyle competition. And I remember somebody came up to me and they were looking at the list of trucks and they knew them all because they knew everybody in it. gonna get the heck up out of Dodge. Scott Green is in the seat and he is... He's been licking his chops, looking at this freestyle track all weekend long. So, yeah, we see the list of names for the freestyle competition, and somebody goes, who the hell is Scott Green? And we're all like, we don't know. And it was just some quiet dude that showed up with the truck, and he came in fourth place that day and made a big impact, and we've seen him all over the place since then. It's been a lot of fun. They're even honking out on the highway.
think there's anybody out here this afternoon having more fun than he is right now. Woo! Yeah, he's got a lot of wiggle room, a lot of room to just land and kind of get the speed up to the next one. with no problem. Says, hey, how y'all doing up here in the corner? coming man this is a freestyle of surprises and we're only into the second truck <laughs> we paced it a little bit but it soaked it up the moose has strong back legs you see and they can absorb that kind of punishment <laughs> I 
Allie's using every square inch of the track. That's fine. I told you she doesn't listen. It's it's fine. It just goes. Oh my word. Ladies, how about that? That's what I'm talking about. That is awesome. What a cool shot that was, standing up like that at the top of that jump. You know, they spent all this time on the faces of it, making them all nice and smooth and pretty, and she just back doors all of them. Boom. You do have to make your own rules. I'm, I'm understanding that now. Of course, I'm learning that a little late in life, but I'll be better now than never, I guess. freestyle type of competition before on this Copperfield just made that truck disappear right in front of our very eyes, ladies and gentlemen. Looking good so far.
Yeah, no sputter, no pop. Oh, I spoke too soon. I do that. Still with a little sputter here and there, but still looking good up over the tabletops and the jumps doing his thing. I'm just glad he could come back out and do it. I know he's he's gonna be much happier about that. I think the backs of the jumps have been hit more than the fronts out here today. That's fine. That was smooth. He made it look. He made it look easy. that he came out again and a nice run hit some good stuff still wasn't running at 100 percent but he was doing his thing putting on a good show and hats off to him for bringing this out i want to thank him for everything that he does and there were they got a thumbs up ladies and gentlemen that's what we like to see i guess he thought it was only fair that somebody roll it over close to those guys as well you know we can't have all the fun right here 